Oh yeah. Right. Now. <laughs> Every day for the last couple of weeks, I've been trying to make sure that I go and get some videos put up. Every single day. Bits of my stand-up. I've been a stand-up comedian for about 20 years and I've got loads of material to get out there. One of the reasons I'm doing this is because this year, for the first time ever, after 20 years as a stand-up, I'm going out on tour. I'm doing my show, Bethany Black, Always Bet on Beth. Uh, I could not think of a better way to go and incorporate my name into the title of the show. Now, normally, every single day, I've been making sure that I've gone and edited these videos together, which means watching my big face and uh, listening to my terrible, terrible voice. Now, this has been going great. Unfortunately, today, I've had a, run into a bit of an issue on account of I've had the most stressful day I have had in ages. On top of everything else, uh, we're currently trying to move house as well. I uh, wouldn't choose to do move house on the same month that uh, I'm starting my tour. However, you know what landlords are like. Landlords be landlording. Anyway, I'm going to try and get some videos out today and get them ready to go. Um, if you are in the Leicester area, I will be doing the first date of this tour on Saturday night at Duffy's Bar as part of the Leicester Comedy Festival. Please do come along. It will be so much fun. I will be telling you the stories of how I went and moved from a big city to a small town, thinking, well, this will be nice, just before COVID hit. I'll be telling you about all sorts of interactions that I've had with the weird local neighbours. I'll also tell you about one of the best things that I've heard. In fact, I'll tell you that now. You know, when you see people who are out and about who are doing this, that I'm doing now into their phones, because but they can do it outside of their house with distractions around them because they have no shame. Walking into Tesco a couple of days ago, beginning middle of, middle of January this year, hoping that this year was going to get back to normal. I heard someone as I was walking around, you know, when you catch part of a conversation, you go, oh, I love that. It's a good conversation. I want to be part of that conversation. I wonder what she's like. She was the sort of person I went, oh, I could just listen to you all day. Right. She had a great voice. But I caught part of the conversation that was absolutely wonderful and then she just disappeared and I want to know what the end of it was because I heard her wandering around. She went, hey, how's your dry January going? I'm not doing the dry January me. I'm doing a no man January me. A no man -uary. If I'd have been a bit more confident, I'd have told her that is still a dry January. But it was the next bit that really got me, right? Because she was walking around and she went, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. Cadbury's cream egg. Oh, I love a cream egg, me. Reminds me of when I was in a car crash. I need to know what the rest of that conversation was because I have absolutely no idea. That is absolutely wonderful. And if you are listening to this and you do know the rest of that story and it was you who I was walking behind in Tesco, please do tell me. I'm very excited to hear it. Otherwise, do come and see the show. Follow my page. Click for links. There's a link in the bio for tickets. You can have a look and see if I'm playing near you. More dates will be announced if enough of you buy tickets, so please do so.